Sports is brought to you by Jim White Honda. In any given game, the goal for every team is to win. Well, at Whitmer, Anthony Stacy has taken those victories and turned them into some amazing moments like the one you see behind me. Rewarding each player of the game with chains. Turns out he's not the only one in the area doing this. Our Tyler Sagerman found out there are plenty of other schools having fun after the games. For some Northwest Ohio teams, it doesn't just end out there. No, when the teams come in here and are amongst themselves, the festivities only begin. For example, here at St. Francis, they've got themselves the lunch pail. Oh, yeah! It's just brought the energy. Uh, during the game, if you're having a tough game, it's just something to shoot for. After the game, winning feels great. It's just that extra boost of energy that really gets us going to the next game, too. This highly desired silver box made its debut this season and is awarded by the Knights team chaplain to one player after every win. May not be the guy that spends the most time on the floor, might not be the most minutes, might not be the most points, but someone who goes out there and just kind of sacrifices everything for that family, everything for this team. And so that's where this came up. <laughs> Down in White House, they too have some swag to give out. Anthony Wayne with the chain. It followed like our six game skid, middle of the season. We were kind of feeling down. Started winning some games again, then all of a sudden at BG, coach comes comes in screaming, holding the chain. We gave it to uh, Bender, and I think it's just been like a big culture change for us. Gives us something to look forward to for winning games. It, it does, it's an extra fun little thing in the locker room after we all, we all splash whoever wins the chain, and it's, it's, it's really fun. These objects aren't just confined to the basketball court. One hockey team has even joined in on the fun as well with a little battle for the belt. I think it's cool like after games to recognize somebody that maybe if it, even if they don't score but they're having a good game, they're working hard, it's a cool way to recognize them. We've had a, uh, some guys that, that like to take pictures with their shirt off uh, for because you know, I put them on Twitter. Right. So they'll take their, their shirt off and they'll have the, the belt draped over them, kind of like a WWE uh, situation. But, you know, it's just every game that we're able to win, it's an opportunity for guys to recognize each other. No matter the coveted item, these teams have found a way to inspire and reward great performance. Best of all, it provides another element of fun to competition. In Lucas County, Tyler Sugerman, WTOL 11.